Are you wondering if the new Garmin Instinct 3 actually gets the latest generation 5 heart rate sensor? So I have some very bad news for you. Uh, the Garmin Instinct 3 actually doesn't get the newest generation 5 heart rate sensor and it actually gets generation 4 older sensor that the Instinct 2 actually had. So and this watch as you can see it's like not even cheap watch and the generation 5 heart rate sensor has been out already for uh, quite a long time basically. So and uh, yeah it really completely blows my mind that is why they are actually not including it uh, in this watch because for example if you uh, look at the old instinct 2 for example uh, that watch uh, basically internally actually had the same like uh, for example heart rate sensor as uh, phoenix line so their most uh, expensive stuff so uh, simply the body was not as premium on the instinct watches but really internally they were uh, just as good but this year for some reason really Again, even despite uh, the like a kind of high price point on this watch, they still aren't including this sensor here. By the way, I actually still think that the Garmin Instinct 3 is actually a really decent watch this year. Uh, and basically, when you look at the heart rate sensor on these uh, older like Garmin watches, uh, actually they aren't bad at all. So even this Generation 4, I think it's still like super super good. So and really, for like 99% of the people, I do not think you'll actually find any problems with the heart rate sensor. So. Yeah, I get it that it's not the newest stuff, but I do not think you will have any problems with the sensor. As from my experience, it, it is actually like a really good sensor. Also, the biggest uh, plus point of the new Instinct 3 is obviously that it has that flashlight as well. Uh, so previously only the largest uh, 2X uh, on the Instinct previous model basically had that. But uh, I kind of wanted to purchase that watch, but I when I looked at it, uh, basically uh, used it, it a bit, it really is, was way, way, way too huge. So again, uh, this is actually kind of cool that we can get basically this flashlight on the much smaller body. And again, uh, even the like this, uh, for example, if you get the memory and pixel display variant, uh, this solar charging also is uh, by default basically on all of them, so you do not have to pay extra. And also the solar charging is actually kind of improved this year on the Instinct 3 as well. So overall still I can probably suggest you this watch and I will be ordering one as soon as it's available to order as well. As I, yeah, I really think it's actually a decent watch so far. Anyway, good luck guys.